Welcome to the Draeger solution for non-invasive respiratory care. In this video, we will demonstrate the step-by-step -step instructions for the application of the BabyFlow Plus and all relevant accessory options. The BabyFlow Plus is available in three different lengths, which are classified as sizes small, medium, and large. It is available with the following accessory options. Measurement tape to measure the infant's head and determine the appropriate size of headgear or disposable caps. Sizing card for mask and prongs. Headgear available in six sizes. Disposable caps available in eight sizes. Prongs available in 11 sizes. Mask available in six sizes. To begin, prepare the ventilator for use. 1. First perform a system check. 2. If the system passes the check, then set the device for use in NIV, non-invasive ventilation mode. 3. Once the mode is set, then perform the ventilator circuit check. In this video, we will show two different size patients, a neonate and a full-term infant, to demonstrate the application of the prongs and the mask, respectively, with the BabyFlow Plus. Start by using the measurement tape to check the head circumference of the patient and the sizing card to identify the appropriate prong size. Based on these measurements, choose the best fit headgear and prong option for the infant. Then choose the best Baby Flow Plus length out of the three offerings. Gently lift the patient's head and position the headgear underneath. Ensure that the headgear is centered and positioned directly on the hairline. For best positioning, avoid wrinkling the material. Notice the headgear is labeled with numbers to help assist you in securing the accessory correctly. First, take the middle strap, number one, and put it over the patient's forehead. Then take strap number two and fold it over the top of strap one. Then take strap number three and do the same. Then fold strap number one back and ensure that it sticks firmly with the Velcro. Now connect the prong with the selected Baby Flow Plus. Ensure that you avoid putting pressure on the patient's septum by placing the Baby Flow Plus at an appropriate angle. Take time to adjust and find the best placement. Take the selected prong and thread the number four headgear strap through one flap on the prong. Thread strap five through the flap on the opposite side of the prong. Position the prong in the nose of the patient and secure the Baby Flow Plus safely on the patient's forehead by using strap six. Connect the Baby Flow Plus to the breathing circuit. At this point, therapy can begin. Now we will show the mask application on the full-term size infant. As previously demonstrated with the neonate patient, measure the head circumference for the appropriate headgear size and use the sizing card to find the best size for the mask. The headgear setup is the same as previously demonstrated. The masks labeled small, medium, and large have similar silicone flaps as the prongs. The masks for larger babies in size 4, 5, and 6 have green clips for securing purposes. Take the selected mask and thread the number 4 headgear strap through the clip. Now connect the mask with the selected Baby Flow Plus. Ensure that the mask is sitting securely enough to avoid leaks, but not so tight that the fixation will result in pressure marks on the patient's nose. Take time to adjust to find the best angle of the Baby Flow Plus connection point. Once the mask is set, thread strap 4 and then strap 5 through the clip on the opposite side of the mask. Secure the Baby Flow Plus safely on the patient's forehead by using strap 6. Connect the Baby Flow Plus to the breathing circuit and now therapy can begin. The Baby Flow Plus, a solution for superior non-invasive respiratory support.